Hi, in this video, we're going to look at how you can communicate in Connect with your teacher and classmates. Connect has inbuilt instant messaging and emailing to make it easier to get in touch with your teacher, whom we'll refer to as your instructor. So let's go ahead now and look at how you can email your instructor from within Connect. We will be starting already logged into Connect. We'll navigate to the unit where you want to contact your instructor. If you need help on logging in, please see the video on how to log into Connect with SSO. You can email your instructor through the minibar if you know their contact information. But if you do not know their specific email, you may be able to find this on the teacher contact widget of your unit homepage. If you are unable to find this information, the best way is through the class list. The class list can be found in the primary navigation under the My Class drop-down. The class list displays the names and profile pictures of everyone enrolled in a specific unit. This includes your instructors, aka your teachers. Under Role, you can see whether they are a student or an instructor and if they are currently online, which is displayed by the green circle next to their name. By default, it will open to include everyone, but you can use the Instructors and Students tabs to show only those specific groups. To email your instructor, you can either select the down chevron next to their name in the Name column, or if you would like to send to multiple recipients, you can select the checkbox next to their profile pictures. Select the recipients that you want to email and then select email above the table. Connect does not allow students to email another student without manually typing in an email address. This is so that individual student email addresses are kept confidential to respect student privacy. From here you can email like normal. Enter a subject Compose your message and select send. You can also send email through the message alerts icon and then select email. Remember that you can only send an email from here if you know and can type in the recipient's email address. Select sent mail to view a table of email messages you have sent. To view the content of a specific email, select the subject title. At the top right of this panel, you can select the settings cog to open your email settings. From here you can select the checkbox if you'd like to send a copy of each outgoing message to your email address. You'll see that the checkbox for saving a copy to your sent mailbox is already checked. You can also add an email signature. Remember to save your changes. When your instructor replies to your message, it will be sent to your nominated email address. The Instant Messages tool is also available via the Message Alert icon and the Class List. You will need to select a recipient before you can access the text message box. Let's have a look at the Instant Message inbox, which can only be accessed via the Instant Message icon at the top. The Inbox tab shows all received instant messages and allows you to set the message to read, unread, or delete. You can designate a contact that you message frequently to the friends list. You can access your friends list at the top here. The Class List tab shows you everyone enrolled in your unit, including other students and your instructor. You can also see who is online and, as a result, may be more likely to respond. Let's send a message to an instructor. While I'm here, I'll also add the instructor to the friends list to make them easier to message in the future. Your instructor will see a message alert the next time they are logged into Connect. Remember that you may not get a response instantly to your message, 
So if you have critical information that you need to share, make sure to use the appropriate form of communication. Communication can make a big difference in your success. So make sure to use these tools to stay in touch with your instructor and fellow students.